Hey guys, up for auction today is this Dodge uh, 3500 one ton flatbed pickup truck. Got the Cummins diesel in it, manual transmission. Guys, we're going to do a full walk around on this unit, show you every side of it. We'll pop the hood, look inside the cab, crank it up, drive it around, tell you everything we know about it as we go along here. This is an over reserve auction. That means this item sells to the highest bidder regardless of price. When the auction is over, the high bidder will be the new owner on this item. We do have a title in the office for this vehicle. It does run and drive. It does have some wear and tear and some bumps and bruises that we'll point out as we go along. Please read the full listing. Uh, please watch this entire video, guys. It contains all the details about the item. We're here every day, Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Come check this item out, any of our other items. If you can't make it down, we're happy for you to give us a call, shoot us an email. We'll answer any questions that you have to the best of our ability. Uh, truthfully and honestly guys and and treat it just like if it was one of us calling and asking you the same thing I'm going to start our walk around here on the front end guys This truck has had the hood and the doors replaced as you can see they're a different color uh, There's bumps and bruises on the fender on the bumper um, There's your front left tire Truck's not rusty. It's not scaly anything like that As you can see this door is off of a 2500, but it's actually a 3500 truck uh, being that the door has been replaced guys there is no uh, VIN sticker inside this door on the truck or on the door itself so that as we noted in the listing that is not there as with a great many of these trucks of this uh, era the dash is totally gone out of it guys these were really really bad to uh, disintegrate when they sit out in the sun and this one is no exception that being said, the plastic piece that the VIN number is usually stamped on, that's usually right here, is not there. It is not there. We're selling the truck that way, guys, with no visible VIN number on the dash or the door. So you're buying it that way. Please be aware of that. If that's a problem for you, uh, please don't bid because that's how we're selling the truck. The seat has got wear here on the corner. Uh, floorboard's been in pretty good shape guys. It is a five-speed manual transmission uh, We'll crank it up here in a minute was after we finish our walk around um, The air is blowing but not cold um, You can see the rest of the dash there guys the tops just completely gone Completely gone headliners fair. It's got some rips and stains and stuff in it as you can see This is the uh, foam padding is all that's left the actual upholstery over the top is gone it's got a good heavy steel flatbed with a headache rack and gooseneck hitch in it, guys. Again, dual rear tires. Not a lot of paint on the frame, but it is not rusted out. Same way with the bed. You guys, here's your good work truck, a farm truck, something to put out on the ranch, haul hay with, feed cows with. Be great for that. Uh, the engine sounds good in it, transmission pulls and all the gears, the clutch feels good, the brakes work, all that good stuff, guys, but it, but she's ugly. All right, y'all pay attention. She's got bumps and bruises, wear and tear all over. Mechanically, the truck seems to be okay, though. We'll pop the hood and take a look underneath there. See those doors? They're, they've been replaced, but they do open and close properly. Clear coats coming off the fender there. Uh, the windshield looks to be in good shape, guys. It's not cracked or broken that we can see. The hood opens and closes properly. It's got that good Cummins 12, uh, 24 valve, uh, six cylinder diesel engine in it, guys. Runs great. Truck actually sounds really, really good. She fires right up off of the key. Uh, not dripping oil or anything out on the ground. Not, no puddles underneath it that we can find. Guys, we just found a VIN tag in the um, uh, owner's manual. Uh, we will verify that that matches the title. Uh, it is not attached to the truck. It's attached to the owner's manual here. It was in the glove box. We just now found it. It uh, shows it to be a uh, manufactured 5 of 99. Uh, we, will, we will verify this with the title, but that's probably the one they took off the original door. Guys. So you get that with it for whatever that's worth, but it's not attached to the truck. 
Got a new battery on this side. Uh, looks like all the fluids are full, guys. Like I say, no oil or anything running out on the ground. We'll fire it up. She cranks right up from the key. guys that you see she does move steer and all that and we'll go inside and look at the dash some more with the truck running again the air is blowing but it's not cold it's, it's blowing just as hot as it can possibly blow truck drove in here guys I'm assuming it'll drive back out we always recommend on old trucks like this so that you haul them out of here. You see the brake lights working there. Because you just never know what's going to happen with an old used truck. But this one's coming right off a local farm. They've been driving it every day, they say. Uh, we're selling it as is, where it is, for no guarantee, guys. But mechanically, the little truck seems to be okay. She seems to be okay. She's just been road hard and, uh, and got the bumps and bruises to prove it. Uh, but the engine sounds good. She shifts out good. Drive straight. Uh, like I say, if you need a work truck or a farm truck, here's one that seems to be okay mechanically. Got good power, good response out of the engine. The throttle takes right off. The lower part of the dash is actually in pretty good shape. Uh, it's missing the trim around the vents and stuff here. We'll turn the uh, blower comes right on, but it's not cold, guys. It's not cold at all. Uh, I don't know if the radio's working. Here by yep. night, Deb said she might bring up. Radio works good. Uh, the brake light stays on all the time. I guess it's just it's just hung. I mean the brake pops right back up guys but the light is staying on all the gauges are showing within range there um, I mean, you see that the tack is not working let's see if the speedometer is working or not the speedometer is working tack is not working there you have it guys here's an old dodge it actually runs really good it drives good it's just got it's just got cosmetic issues selling it that way if you have any questions want to come look at it here at run drive it it's here on our yard come take a look at it uh, otherwise good luck with the auction <laughs>